Hi everyone. Welcome to today's lesson three. Listen and talk too. Is it okay if? Today we will learn how to use this phrase. You can find this lesson on pages forty-eight and forty-nine of your textbook. Okay, let's begin. Here is the agenda for today's lesson. First, we will do the warm-up. Then, we will learn about the phrase "Is it okay if?" And finally, we will play a game. Let's take a look at the warm-up phrases. I need to get up early tomorrow. Is it okay if I wake you up? No, thanks. I'll be okay. Sounds good. I'll see you in school then. Okay. Let's take a look at another example. I'm hungry. I really want to eat food. Is it okay if I make you a sandwich? Yes, please. What do you want on your sandwich? Ham, cheese, lettuce, and tomatoes, please. Here's another example. This computer game is too difficult. Is it okay if I complete it for you? No, thanks. I can do it myself. You should practice more then. I'm cold. It's freezing outside. Is it okay if I close the window? Yes, please. Why is the window open in the winter anyway? I like the cold air. It makes me feel alive. Here's the last example. I think the Hulk is cooler than Iron Man. What makes you think so? Well, he's big and green. He has big muscles and smashes cars. I see. Is it okay if I borrow your Hulk comic book? These are the examples of the phrase we will learn about today. There are a few different ways to use this phrase, so let's take a look now. Is it okay if you or I? You can use this phrase when you want to ask to do something. You would say, "Is it okay if I?" In the examples we looked at, this is the style we used. Or when you want someone else to do something, you can say, "Is it okay if you?" For example. Is it okay if you make me a sandwich? Is it okay if is a more polite way to ask, "Can you?" To offer help. You have a problem. In this situation, I will say. Is it okay if I? Do you want me to, or can I help you? Have the same meaning. Someone else. I have a problem. Is it okay if you? Can you help me? These are the two ways to use this phrase.
When someone asks you, is it okay if, you have to answer yes or no. Let's look at this example. Is it okay if I eat your KFC? Yes, go ahead. Or, sorry, you can't. Let's take a look at another one. Is it okay if I stay up to play League of Legends? Yes, go ahead. Sorry, you can't. Okay, did you get it? How about this one? I'm hungry. What should I do? What can you ask? You should eat some food. So, you can ask, Is it okay if you make me a sandwich? Please repeat after me. Is it okay if you make me a sandwich? How about this one? I'm cold. What should I do? You should put on a sweater and shouldn't wear shorts in winter. Or you can ask, Is it okay if you turn on the heat? Repeat after me. Is it okay if you turn on the heat? Here's another example. I failed my driving test. What can I do to improve? Is it okay if you help me practice my driving? Please repeat after me. Is it okay if you help me practice my driving? Is it okay if I study more? Is it okay if I drive slowly? Okay, how about this situation? It's Friday night and I have to clean my room. Repeat after me. Is it okay if you help me clean? Is it okay if you don't make a mess? Very good. Okay. Game time. Please read the situation. Think of how you can answer. Good luck. I got a bad haircut. And now I look like Pororo. What should I do? Hmm, is it okay if you fix my hair? Okay, let's take a look at another one. <coughs> I'm sick. Hmm, what can you ask for? Is it okay if 
I take some medicine. I am hungry. Hmm. What should we say? Is it okay if... Is it okay if I eat some food? These bags are too heavy. Is it okay if... Is it okay if you help me carry them? My PC broke. How can we answer this question? Is it okay if... Ah, is it okay if you fix it for me? I have to get up early tomorrow. What can we say? Is it okay if... Is it okay if I set an alarm? I am late for my date, but I smell bad. What should I do? Here's my answer. Is it okay if I take a shower at your house? Oh my goodness! IU is standing next to me at Emart. What should I do? Hmm. Ah, I know. Is it okay if I get your autograph? Okay, excellent work. What answers did you think of? Now let's take a look at the review of today's lesson. For Is it okay if? We looked at different situations. You can use this phrase. For example, is it okay if you or is it okay if I? You can use this phrase when you want to do something or ask to do something. And when you want someone else to do something. It is a more polite way to ask, can you or can I? That's all for today's lesson. I hope you enjoyed it. Until next time, bye-bye.